Hello Puggies, it's Donna and Charles from Pug Parties and today we want to share with you our tips and tricks to dress your pug in a jumper because your pug deserves to be the best dressed at the party. The great thing about jumpers is that they're warmer than a t-shirt which is perfect for those really cold days and they can be worn under a harness or as part of an outfit. Now when dressing your pugs we've found that we can do it one of two ways. You can put them on a table like this or you can kneel on the ground, have them sitting between your knees. We do this to maintain control for quick and comfortable dressing. Both of these methods are especially effective if you're dressing your pug by yourself. But if there are two of you, we found it's best done on a table with one, excuse me Charles, with one holding the hind quarters whilst the other is dressing. Some of the other things that we'll do in preparation is that we'll have the jumper out ready to go and within easy reach. And if the jumper happens to have buttons or press studs at the collar line, we'll also undo those. Something else we'll do is that we'll have our puppy's favorite treats in our pocket so that we can reward them as needed. And we'll also talk to them the entire time because the sound of your voice is reassuring. Hey, Gus will give him a, a pat. Now when dressing Charles in a jumper, I start with the neck and then each sleeve in turn, leaning over him to get access to his paws as needed. With the jumper itself, I'll gather it up so that I've got a nice big hole. Excuse me, Charles. Just turn you around a little bit just so it's a bit easier. And then that way, getting it on across the head is actually a lot easier. I'll unravel the jumper a little bit because what that does is that then allows me a lot better access to guide his paw through the first sleeve, hand over puppy. And then the next one, okay? Providing as much of a stable environment for him as possible, okay? Then once it's on, we pull it down, come around here, good boy, uh, and then position in place. Now, if you find that the sleeves are a little too long, I highly recommend that you roll them up a little bit because what you don't want is your pug to trip over. Okay? Now, don't forget, if your jumper is the sort of jumper that has a couple of press studs uh, or buttons at the collar to do them up, because what happens if you don't is that they roll down or the neck, it rolls down at the neck and then it falls off one, hey, hey, one sleeve at a time. The best part is at the end of all of this, you have a pug that's ready to party or go to sleep. Hey, don't you look handsome? So thank you so much for joining Charles and I today. We have other videos and articles to help you shop and dress for your pug and you'll find links to those in the comments section below. If you found this video helpful, please leave a review, tell your friends and become a Grubble friend yourself via our website. Grubble membership gives you exclusive access to dressing and shopping guides and our Size My Puggy button which helps you find the perfect fit for your pug's clothes first time every time. So until next time, puggies, have fun and party like only a pug can. Okay, you say goodbye.